Hello and hola. Welcome to Yoga with Chris. In this practice, we are cultivating our self-love. Be prepared to be your own Valentine. Today we're featuring Kai the Sign Co. And we want to thank her for helping us with the beautiful Valentine's theme transitions. In order to be someone else's Valentine, we must love ourselves first, but it has to be an unconditional love. Stay with me until the end of this practice and find some positive affirmations that can increase our self-love. Let's bring our knees mat width apart, big toes together, setting our hips on or close to our heels and letting our forehead resting on our mat. Bringing our attention to our breath, making sure we're inhaling and exhaling through our nose. We can rest our hands on the side of our head, inhaling deeply and slowly. Exhaling slowly and gently. I am brave. I am brave. I am brave. Being brave doesn't mean that we don't have fears. Being brave means we are strong and bold enough to overcome our fears. Letting go all our fears. I am brave. Letting go any judgment or competition. I am brave. Moving our hands to the side of our feet and then bringing them behind the back, interlacing our fingers. If for any reason we cannot reach, we can use a belt, a strap, a small towel, or even one of our socks that we just took off before starting. Noticing that just keeping our hands behind our back without straightening our arms and the dynamic tension caused by pulling our hands away from our shoulders won't have the same effect. So let's search for any object that can help us to reach, to connect one hand with the other. Inhaling, exhaling, after one more breath, releasing our hands and gently bringing them back to the mat first by our feet and then by our face bringing our hands overhead lengthening our arms leaning our body forward bringing our knees hip width apart and tucking our toes, making sure we open our fingers wide like a starfish, aligning our shoulders right above our wrists and inhaling as we lift our tailbone, lifting also our chest to the skies, exhaling, tucking our tailbone and tucking our chin to our chest, inhaling tailbone and chest up, Exhaling, tucking our tailbone and chin, opening our chest as we inhale and bringing our belly button closer to our spine as we exhale. Inhaling. And let's sit our hips back as we exhale really slow. And coming back to center. Let's push your knees back. Wrists underneath our shoulders. Opening our starfish hands. Meeting in a modified plank and then lifting our knees off the mat. 
feeling that we're really pushing the mud away from us. And then leading the movement with our tailbone, lifting our hips to the ceiling, pointing our tailbone up, pushing the mat to the front with our hands and to the back with our feet. If you're enjoying this video, give it a like, share it with your friends and follow Kai at Kai Design Co on Facebook and Kai Detalles on Instagram. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If this stance is not comfortable for us, we can take a wider stance or a closer one, it's our choice. Leaning forward, meeting on a plank. And lifting our hips up again leading with our tailbone, pedaling our feet to give an extra stretch to our calves. And then lifting our left leg up, bringing that foot between our hands, securing our stance, gently dropping our right knee to the mat, and sweeping our arms overhead for the modified or supported crescent moon. Making sure we are pointing our tailbone down, feeling the stretch in our hip flexors, looking towards the ceiling, inhaling, exhaling, opening our arms wide, showing our chest, our heart to our right side of the mat, coming back to center, and barely twisting our torso to the left side of our mat. And as we come back to center, giving ourselves a hug, a big one. Telling ourselves how important we are, repeating, I love myself. I'm the most important person in my life. I will only be good to someone else if I love myself first. And opening our arms wide again, inhaling arms up, exhaling hands to the mat, stepping this foot back, meeting in puppy pose, Pointing our hips to the skies, pushing the mat forward with our hands, lifting the knees of the mat, downward facing dog, pedaling the feet, lifting the right leg up and bringing the right foot to the front, framing it with our hands, dropping the left knee to the mat, Inhaling, hands up. Exhaling, tilting our hips and pointing the tailbone to the mat. Inhaling with our hands overhead. Exhaling, opening our arms wide, showing our heart to the left side of our mat. Gently coming back to center and rotating in the opposite direction. And when we're back to center, giving ourselves another big hug. I release the need to judge myself negatively. I am worthy of love and joy. I am worthy of my own trust. I am worthy. I am worthy. I am worthy. Repeating these to ourselves as much as we need every day until there are no doubts about it. Opening our arms wide and bringing our hands up as we inhale. Exhaling hands to the mat. 
stepping our right foot back, finding ourselves back in this modified plank, lifting our knees, meeting in a full plank, inhaling, exhaling as we lift our hips led by our tailbone. Stretching our calves and pedaling our feet to go a little deeper in that stretch. Again, leaning forward, breathing slowly and deeply. Lifting our hips to the skies and little by little, walking to the front of the mat, bending our knees a lot, as much as we need so we can keep our hands planted on the mat. Inhaling halfway lift, straightening our knees and our back, rolling our shoulders back and down. Exhaling hands to the mat, lifting our hips to the skies, inhaling, sweeping our arms up, Exhaling all the way down and pointing our tailbone up. Inhaling halfway lift, shoulders back and down. Exhaling forward fold, hips high. And speaking about hips, I have a video to help you with your hips. If you have arthritis or even for the piriformis syndrome, check the link in the upper right corner. Inhaling all the way up, exhaling all the way down, inhaling halfway, exhaling forward fold, inhaling bringing our hands to our extended mountain and exhaling as we sweep our arms down, let's clasp our hands behind our back and hinging from the hips, softening our knees, bending over, finding our forward fold, pretending we want to touch the ceiling with our hands, and at the same time trying to bring our chest to our mat. If you feel like you're learning something new about our body, I kindly ask you to consider leaving a donation through PayPal, Venmo, or Cash App. Thank you. Gently releasing our hands, letting our arms and head hang down, leaning our ribs on our thighs, pointing that tailbone up and hugging our legs. We're giving ourselves a hug again, reminding our body how important it is to us. Letting our legs go and now holding our arms, letting our head and arms hang down. I am enough and my heart knows it. I am enough and I'm on my side. I am enough. Releasing our arms, straightening our legs and back for a halfway lift. Forward fold as we exhale, inhaling all the way up. Exhaling, planting hands on the mat. Stepping both feet back, meeting in down dog. We may notice that at this point, our heels are getting closer to the mat and we should be very proud of ourselves because that is some progress. But more than anything, because we are doing something for our body and for our mind. Leaning forward, plank one breath only in this plank. Gently dropping our knees to the mat, 
and let's open them mud width apart big toes together arms overhead lengthening our arms lifting our tailbone for our extended child's pose i take care of myself i love my body and all it does for me today i choose me i choose to take care of myself i let go of my past and live in the present because i take care of myself letting our hips to sit on our heels bringing our hands to the side of our head first then taking them behind our back let's interlace our fingers and with our hands pulling away from our shoulders let's focus on our breath inhaling very deep as we feel how our belly and ribs get expanded exhaling and noticing how the opposite movement happens in our belly and ribs i love myself above all the things and people i believe in me i can achieve anything i set my mind to i believe in me i love myself releasing our hands and letting them rest either on the side of our feet or the side of our head preparing for our moment of relaxation our shavasana staying focused on our breath inhaling self-love exhaling our fears inhaling love exhaling and letting go all the negativity I am brave, I am worthy, I am enough, and I am on my side. I take care of myself, I love my body, I believe in me, I love myself. We may have noticed that we made several poses and flows to open our chest. The intention was to open our heart. By opening our heart, the love for ourselves will grow freely without any compression. Let's open our chest and our heart every day. To bring our body awareness back, let's gently wiggle our fingers and toes. Setting our hands right underneath our shoulders and keeping our eyes closed, let's push the mat away from us to find our comfortable seated position. dropping our chin to our chest gently opening our eyes sweeping our arms up as we inhale catching the blessings from the universe between our hands and bringing them to our heart thank you for practicing self-love with me today. Namaste.